Hi guys, welcome back here to Drone Emotion, a channel where we do drone videos and where we cover the most relevant drone news. Today my friends, we're back here once again with a brand new video and this time we're going to be talking about, about all of the final specs for the DJI FPV drone. So in the past, a couple of days ago, we still didn't have all of the specs regarding the FPV drone. So there were still a lot of questions that people had such as how big was the camera sensor, the weight of the drone and a whole lot more info. Don't worry, today we have all of the specs for the DJI FPV drone. So if you've been wanting to know all of the specs about this brand new DJI drone, don't worry because you have come to the right place. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, welcome here and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so that you can keep up to date with the latest drone news because in this channel we will always be the first ones to bring you the latest drone news and also we're getting close to 5,000 subscribers so I will truly appreciate you guys if you could help us get there so we can get to our goal of 5,000 which we're very very close and I truly appreciate all of your guys' support. So with that being said, let's go ahead and dive right into today's video which is going to be a very very exciting one. So by now in case you haven't seen the DJI FPV drone, I don't know what you've been doing but don't worry, I'm gonna go ahead and leave a picture of the FPV drone for all of you guys that haven't seen it yet. So here we have it in screen. So there's the DJI FPV drone. So let's go ahead, my friends, and get started with the specs that we have for this new drone because I think this will be a really, really fun drone to fly. As we've mentioned before, it's going to be some sort of hybrid drone. It's going to be a mix between a Mavic drone and an FPV drone. Okay, so first thing, let's get started and talk about the weight of this drone. How heavy is this drone going to be? Well, this drone is going to have a weight of 790 five grams okay so quite heavy my friends definitely a lot more heavier than the Mavic Air 2 this one is below the 600 grams mark I will say it's closer to what we find on the Mavic 2 Pros okay so pretty close to that mark which is almost around 900 on the Mavic 2 Pros so FB drone weight of 795 grams so quite heavy you're still going to need to register your drone in most countries i believe okay now let's talk about the flight time how long will this drone stay in the air well on paper the fpv drone will have a flight time of 21 minutes will it last that long well unfortunately not and that's the cases with all drones okay and the flight time will is going to be based upon the use that you give your drone. So in the normal conditions, this drone will give you a flight time, I will say of around 15 to 18 minutes. So keep in mind, this is going to depend on how hard you fly the drone, how fast you go, because remember, the more faster and aggressive that you fly the drone, the faster the battery is going to drain. So I will expect something between 15 and 18 minutes in real world scenario, okay? Now let's talk about top speed. What would the top speed of this drone be? Well, it will have a top speed of 150 kilometers per hour, which is somewhere around 90 miles per hour. So definitely an extremely, extremely fast drone. And I think that this is something that the DJI FPV drone needs to have because all FPV drones in general are very fast. And I think that's a very important thing for the FPV drone to have. And well, it looks like DJI is going to deliver that to all of us. Now, let's talk about the battery. So this drone is going to have a 2000 million per battery as we already mentioned in previous videos but here we have a picture of the battery that this new drone will have there we have it so as we already mentioned we talked about the flight time now let's go ahead my friends and talk about a surprise that i got with this drone from from dji so we're going to be able to, to have with this new drone we're going to have removable canopies and they're going to be available in different colors so if you missed the unboxing video of the FPV drone, make sure you check it out, it's a really good video. So that's going to be in the channel in case you missed it. So this drone is going to have removable canopies, so it's going to come as standard with a matte translucent canopy. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it right here on the screen in just a second. And with the FPV combo, it's in a uh, lime green canopy is going to be included so that we can switch in between colors so that we can customize our drone right here on the screen. And there we have it. So I really like that DJ is bringing that back to, 
on what we find it on the DJI Tello and on the Spark. I really like the fact that we can customize our drone. Hopefully, we get more colors soon whenever the drone is launched. So I'm really expecting to see more colors, okay? So I think that's something nice, a little nice touch that DJI gave us. Let's talk about the camera sensor size. It's going to have a 1 over 2.5 three inch sensor okay so this is the same size sensor that what we find on the original mavic pro mavic air mavic mini mini 2 okay so it's a little bit smaller than what we'll find on the mavic air 2 this is a half inch sensor and what we are going to find on the fpv drone is going to be a 1 over 2.3 inch sensor does that mean that the quality is going to be bad no of course not just when it comes to low light scenarios obviously the bigger the sensor the better it's going to perform but the quality that we're going to be getting from this camera is going to be more than enough for everyone and i think that the quality will be phenomenal okay now what will the frame rate be how how good can this camera film well we're going to be able to shoot up to 4k 60 frames per second or 4k 50. also we're going to have the option to record at 1080p which is full hd at up to 120 frames per second so i really like the quality and the different variation that dji is giving us so quite nice also, let's talk about the ISO range, okay? We have an ISO range between 100 and 3200. So, very wide. I like that DJ is giving us, once again, a wide spectrum for the ISO range, which is pr pretty important to have. Now, let's talk about the video clips and, uh, and what format are they going to be compressed into. So, we're gonna be, the DJ FPV drone is going to be using H.264 or H.265 codec for the video clips okay now let's talk about the field of view of the camera so this camera is going to be utilizing a 150 degree view okay and it's going to have and it's going to be a two axis gimbal camera okay it will not be a three axis i repeat it will not be a three axis so i'm gonna go ahead and leave a picture of the camera nice little close-up okay so there we have it. it's going to be a two axis gimbal with a 150 degree field of view also now let's go and talk about the obstacle avoidance so we're gonna be having sensors with this drone okay and we're going to be having forward and downward obstacle avoidance and something that's really nice is that the that during the fpv mode which is the fastest mode sensors are still going to be enabled so this is really going to prevent us from crashing this drone so i think that's something really important also let's talk about the controller so i'm gonna go ahead and leave it right here in screen then we have the controller it has a weight of 346 grams and it has a maximum range of 10 kilometers okay in fcc and six kilometers in european ce mode so most likely the fpv mode will be utilizing oxing 2.0 okay and also this drone is going to be a gps drone so of course we're going to be having a button for return to home okay now let's talk about the dji goggles b2 okay now we know that the fpv combo is going to call the new goggles from dji the b2 goggles which are an upgraded version from the b ones and they have a, a weight of 420 grams they have a 1800 million per battery which are going to give us around 110 minutes of use which is really really good my friend so those are all of the specs that we have for the dji fpv drone i think that the specs are definitely phenomenal i think that dji has done a great job so now we're just waiting to see when this new drone is going to come out from dji we're just missing on their announcement so that's all i have for all of you today thank you for watching and see you tomorrow with a brand new video drone emotion signing out